Hey, what's up, what's happening? You already know what it is and who it is. It's your boy Q Walker, AKA Nephew Q, one third of the hit podcast, He Said, She Said. And what I'm gonna be doing right now is bringing you guys every so often a weird ass story. You hear this right, a weird ass story that you may or may not have heard in the news. But let's get on into today's story. So this one takes place in City Park, New Orleans, Louisiana. Yeah, that's right. The dirty, dirty home of Lil Wayne, Voodoo, Creo, Gumbo, Cash Money Records, No Limit Records, Master P, make them say, uh, na 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 na. But anyways, let's stick to the story in hand. So like I said, this story takes place in City Park, New Orleans. And it involves a young man allegedly committing an unwanted sex act. Now, I know you guys are probably thinking, well, people have sex all the time at work or in the parking lot or in the park or in the bathroom or just wherever. And, you know, people are like, well, so how is this a weird ass story or any different from any other story? I'm going to get right on into that. So this story, like I said, takes place in New Orleans. And now New Orleans police believe they have found a person of interest in a case involving a, a young man having sex with at least two horses at City Park in December. So I'm gonna bring up this young man's picture so y'all can see who I'm talking about real quick one time for the one time. And this is the young man right here, Mr. Koshan Baker, I hope I'm saying his name right. And police are looking for Koshan Baker, 23. He could be connected to a crime caught on video during an investigation into sexual abuse to animals on December 15th in the 1000 block of Fillmore Avenue. Around 2.15, an unknown male wearing a striped shirt with distinctive tattoo on his right arm entered a cluster of stables and committed unnatural sex act with two horses. On Wednesday, detectives received a DNA hit for the person of interest and secured a swab warrant for him. So let me bring up the picture right quick of the alleged video at hand. All right, here. Uh, all right, so this is the alleged video that they call him going into the, the stable of horses to allegedly commit unwanted sexual acts. So, man, let's, let's, let's think about this for a second, bro. Mr. Baker. There are 75 kabillion women out here in this world. As a matter of fact, let me rephrase that. 75 kabillion beautiful women out here in the world. You couldn't go grab or, you know, talk to a young lady and, you know, handle your business. Damn all of that. You could have went on one of the corners of one of the working girls, slid her $20, $30 or whatever your budget allows, have her handle that business for you. But you wanted to go to a stable and have sex with not one, but two damn horses? Like, you went into the stable looked at a horse and said yeah i want that but not only that you looked at another horse and was like damn i want her too like bro what was going through your mind at this point and i know this may sound bad i know this may sound horrible but for the sake of mr baker when he gets to, to county lockup or whatever the case may be for this alleged uh sec unwanted sexual act i hope he was geeked out of his mind when he did this i hope somebody slipped him a mickey I hope that somebody put something in his weed if he was smoking or whatever the case may be because there is no way in hell I'm going to believe a sober dude went into a stable, looked at a horse and was like, yeah, I want that one. And then not only that, looked at another horse and was like, shit, I want her friend too. Like, I, I can't believe that, man. I, and I know there's a such thing called bestiality, but I'm not going to even get into all of that because that's just weird all in itself. But Mr. Baker is our weird ass story of the day, which I can't believe this dude, you know, allegedly uh, committed unnatural sex acts with not one, but two horses. It's the two horse part for me. Like it's one thing to do it to one horse, which is gross enough, but, you, but two, but two, you couldn't get enough, bro. You had to get a, you had to hit another horse. Man, like I said, that story is just totally crazy all in within itself. The whole horse and two horse things. Like, did they have a menage? Like, I, how did that even happen? Anyways, so anyways, that's our weird ass story. And if you have any weird ass stories that you would want me to go over and showcase and highlight, please send them to team he said she said at gmail.com. Or you can also send them to the Facebook page, inbox us, He Said, She Said Radio. I'll go over your weird-ass story with a shout-out to you. So please, if you have a weird-ass story, send it on in to us so we can go over it. Also, make sure that you tune into the Facebook Live Show every single Thursday at 6.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Well, that's your weird-ass story for your boy Q Walker. I'm about to get on up out of here. Y'all have a safe and easy one. Peace.